Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to find social media marketing clients. Now, whether this be e-commerce clients, whether they be info product clients, this works for virtually all different type of clients that you are looking to find. And I highly recommend you watch till the end because what I'm gonna do is show you how you can get this exact document that we built out that essentially helps you organize all of the different prospects that you are actually finding to then pitch. If you also wanna know how we actually pitch the same exact clients. I have a video, I recorded a 30 minute video, uh, which I'll go ahead and link in the description of this video. Uh, it's by far the best way of actually pitching individuals to work with you. So this video is how to find these people. And then the other video is actually how to pitch them once you actually have found them. So again, I'll go ahead and give you this document. This is a really awesome document. What it does is basically help us organize all of the different prospects that we have found. So as you can see here, we have different status based on what we have done with this client. So let's say, you know, we have a client that we haven't pitched you know, we'll go ahead and put it on open. Let's say we have a client that we uh, need to follow up with. We'll go ahead and make the status follow up. We can go ahead and change it to waiting, meaning that we pitched them and we're still waiting. Uh, we also have closed, meaning this client is 100% closed. And then we have done, which means this client does not want to work with us. They either told us they don't want to work or we followed up numerous times and they still haven't replied. So this is a really awesome document. We'll also go ahead here and link their Instagram, their ad library. We'll link the date that you first sent them a message. We'll also link the date that they first open up your email. And uh, in the other video that I mentioned in the description, I'm gonna show you exactly how you can find out when they opened the video. We also have a section for first replied, yes or no. We have uh, you know the first follow-up, so on and so forth. You know, We also have a different section here, which basically helps us organize the next people to pitch. Now I have it my sheet right here, but I'm not gonna go ahead and open up and actually expose the uh, clients and prospects. But essentially, you know, once you're finding like a hundred different clients, you're gonna need to be organized. So the reason we have these right here is because it helps us organize by who are the people that we need to pitch next. Uh, over here, it helps us organize the different prospects links. So what we do is we basically record, let's say 10 to 20 videos at one point or at one time. And then what we do is send these out at once right that rather than recording a video and then sending it one and then doing the same thing over and over again we like to work efficiently so what that means is that we basically need to have a system like this where we can literally record one day send videos out the next day and then so on and so forth and then last but not least here we have what's called the pipeline and essentially what this is is I'm going to show you right now we're going to actually find these clients or prospects using instagram and you know you might be like on the couch you know watching tv or passing time and you can actually find prospects in the meantime while you're doing whatever you're doing and essentially what we do is we go ahead and we put them here in this pipeline and then once we actually have you know an hour or two we can sit down and actually go ahead and onboard these prospects into here for us to then later pitch so this is a really awesome document i'm going to go ahead and give it to you just make sure you watch this video to the end because i promise we'll get a lot of value out of it and it'll also tell you how you can get this document now without further ado let's go ahead and get right into it so as i mentioned the way we're going to go ahead and find social media marketing clients is via instagram and there's a lot of softwares out there but this is absolutely free and it's by far the best method we haven't spent a single dollar to actually find clients so First thing you need to do is go ahead and find an ideal prospect that you would love to work with. So this doesn't necessarily mean someone that you can actually take on if they're you know too big of a brand. Just find someone in your niche. So let's say for this example, we are going after someone who's in the jewelry niche. What we'll do is we'll go ahead and come here to Instagram and we'll go ahead and type in their name. So as you can see here, we have Moon Magic, which is a big jewelry company. And as you can see here, it automatically open up their Instagram page. But what's unique and the reason we want to do this is because we want to utilize is the Instagram feature of suggested users. So if you see this button right here on the top right, and if you click on it, it'll give us different suggested Instagram page. Now, because we're looking at a brand, we're going to get mostly brands. And as you can see here, now we have a whole list of different types of individuals that we can that would be potential prospects. Right. And again, what we now do is we basically look through it. So let's see this one. We will go ahead and right click on it, open a new tab. We'll open up their Instagram. Um, this 
company looks like they have a little less than a million it says empowered by women founded by women women ran so which is really awesome because if that's like your niche right up your alley that would be a good prospect so what we can also do then is go ahead and open up their website to get a look at the what their website looks like but also to go ahead and onboard them into this document which i have right here so as you can see here um this is their document it looks like they only have their facebook picture they don't have their snapchat or tiktok pixel so what now we want to do is go ahead and click on or copy their um their instagram handle and what we want to do now is look them in the facebook ad library to see if they are running any ads so you basically go to facebook slash ad slash library and we'll go ahead and do all all ads and then we'll just go ahead and copy their url or their instagram handle and as you can see this is them right here so we'll take a look see if they're running any ads looks like they're running 53 different ads so literally in a matter of less than a minute we found a prospect we found their ad library to see if they are running any ad and we also have you know their website so as you can see here they're running ads so this is probably like perfect these guys are already running ads these are people that i can pitch this is an ideal prospect so now what we want to do is a couple of things the first thing is you want to make sure you have the hunter chrome extension downloaded to your computer and essentially i explained this again in the other video which again i'll leave in the description so make sure you check it out after this uh, video on how to pitch these prospects but what this is basically a Chrome extension that when you click on it and you hover at any website, it'll give you the different emails that are in on this website. So as you can see here in this website, we have one, two, three, four, four different emails that Hunter IO Chrome extension went ahead and scraped. So why is this important? Well, this is important because now we actually have an email to go ahead and send this email, whatever the way you're pitching these people, you have an email to actually contact them. So let's say we want to go ahead and use hello. So we'll copy that. And now what we're going to do, you guys, is is come back over here and let's go ahead and um, fill this out. So again, like I said, this is an ideal prospect. So we're like, okay, great. So now what we wanna do here is go ahead here and start filling this out. So we'll audit, make this open. We'll type in their name, local, E-C, uh, L-E-C-T-I-C, website. We'll go ahead and copy their website, which is this right here. Come back and paste it in here. Again, we'll also copy their Instagram. Uh, so right here, I'll copy the URL, come back into this document, paste it, and then we'll copy the ad library. And again, you guys, the reason you want to do this is because we're going to be finding hundreds of different prospects. So you want to make sure that, you know, you're actually organizing this, right? You want to make sure that it's all organized. So let's go ahead and make this a little bit neater. So um, what I actually recommend is you guys use bit.ly. I actually use bit.ly to make these URLs a little bit smaller. I'm not going to do it for the sake of this video but yeah you want to use bitly to make these look a little bit smaller um, that way they can fit perfectly on the page and that is that is that right so once we actually sit down to pitch them we're actually going to go ahead and fill out you know this information right here we just found one right now let's go ahead and find some more so as you can see here we have max uh, mac cosmetics we have fenty we probably don't want to pitch those given that they're a big company we have sheen that's a huge company they probably have their own in-house and then we have michella right here so we'll go ahead and do the same thing open this in a new tab and we'll go ahead and take a look at their Instagram right so as we can see here here's their Instagram right so I'm um, 65,000 followers which is perfect so they're probably not too big not too small of a potential prospect we'll go ahead and copy their their Instagram and we'll type it into ad library to see if they're running any ads six results so that's perfect right um, we can also see that they only have one person managing their ads so it looks like that they're running these ads themselves so this would be a perfect potential prospect to pitch because one they're already invested in facebook ads but two they're not they're doing it themselves and it looks like they're only running them on instagram um, so this is great for us because this is where we would be able to pitch these individuals and have a higher chance of actually closing them given that they are interested in facebook ads but don't have an agency so again what we would do now is come back here copy their url and what I actually recommend you guys is you don't fill it out at one time. What I recommend you do right now is simply go to the pipeline section and just go ahead and paste their URL because what you want to do is make this as efficient as possible. So the first thing you want to do is actually find the prospects. And then once you found, let's say 50 prospects, you want to then come back here and fill out this form, right? So let's make, you know, you want to make this as, as streamlined as possible, right? You wanna make it as streamlined as possible. So we'll just go ahead and fill them out in the pipeline, right? So we'll go ahead and uh, you know cancel out of this, cancel out of this. Now let's go back to this initial one and we'll go ahead and look for a few more. Moonlight Jewelry Co, we'll go ahead and open this up. And as you can see here, 253. 
Okay, so let's go ahead and copy this Instagram handle and paste it in ad library to get an idea on if they're running ads or not. And once you find their page, go ahead and click on it. So it looks like these guys are not running any ads. And again, they only have one person managing their page. So maybe for you, this is like, okay, great. This is a great client. Perfect. We can pitch them, copy the uh, their Instagram handle, and then paste it here into pipeline, right? So as you can see how fast this can be, right? We can find a whole bunch of different um, prospects and we're streamlining it by just copying their uh, Instagram handle, putting them into our pipeline. And then what we do is go back and actually fill out this form to then pitch them. So let's go ahead and take a look at this. Uh, looks like again, jewelry company. Let's see if they're running any ads. And when we go ahead and click on this, it looks like they're running 19 different ads. They have five people in India, three people in Slovenia, and two people in the United States. So it looks like these guys probably have someone that's running their ads, which is perfect, right? So now we can go ahead and use this, copy that you, uh, Instagram handle, go back to the sheet, and then paste it in here, right? And then move on to the next one. I hope you guys get the idea of how this works, right? Now, you can literally find hundreds, hundreds, and hundreds of different clients. I wish I can show you guys my sheet, but I'm not gonna obviously open it up in this video. But once you have, let's say about 50 different people or even 100 people, as you can see, it takes you anywhere between 30 to 60 seconds to actually find these people. But once you actually found a good number of prospects, what you wanna do then, as I mentioned, is come back here, put in their name, put in their website, put in their Instagram, put in their ad library. And then what you wanna do is click the link down below to make sure you pitch them the right way. So it's not a way where you pitch them in just an email. Literally business owners get hundreds of email every day. The way you wanna be pitching these people is what's called the perfect cold video pitch. And essentially what that is, it's a 10 to 15 minute video where you give these prospects a CPR clear process to revenue as to why they should actually work with you. So I go really in depth in showing you how you can actually close these clients. So I highly recommend you go ahead and watch that video. With that being said, you guys, that is basically how you can go ahead and find social media marketing clients. If you want this exact document right here, all you got to do is go ahead and send me a message on Instagram, shoot me a follow and send me a message on Instagram. And I'll go ahead and send you a copy of this exact document, which will actually help you organize your prospects. As you can see here, really organized. You'll actually be able to keep track of you've actually, have you pitched this person? Are you still waiting for them? All that good stuff. So if you want this, go ahead and shoot me a message on Instagram. I hope this video was helpful. You guys go ahead and watch that other video below on how to pitch them. And I will see you guys in the next one.